Hello, false here. How are you? Well, I hope you are fine and okay. Um, I tell you, today we are going to check pages 36, 37, 38, plus the mistakes from the video, unit 5. Yes, okay, I was drinking some water. Yes, and we are going to do pages 62, 63, 64, 65 and 68 from the class book. Yes, uh, remember, señores padres, su hijo tendrá revisión de la unidad 5 el día 21 de 5 notificado. Study for next class, okay? All unit 5. Homework pages 40, 41, 42 from the activity book plus a formal letter. Yes, okay, you have to see exercise 4 and 5 from the class book. This is the letter from the class book, yes, okay? You have to react, yes, okay, to any of these situations, yes? Your colleague is going to close the student cafeteria. Your favorite TV show is being scrapped. Your employer... School has banned junk food and drink machines. Or your local swimming pool is being closed. Yes, you have an example here of a formal letter. Yes, okay. We are going to see it then. Yes, okay. Um, if you want or if you have problems for organization of paragraphs and everything, there is a guide here on page 42 that's why i wrote on the homework you can see the guide from page 42 yes and the organization yes okay is it clear so let's go to uh the correction of the activity book yes okay activity book pages 36 37 and 38, 36, 37 and 38, all right, there we go, good videos, yes, good videos, yes, okay, I'm going to explain uh, mistakes, yes, all the things you have to um, concentrate for next video, on the next video, but I'm very proud, yes, okay, good. Well, um, wait a minute, okay, number two, exercise two from page 36, are you there? Good, simple, a simple steak, A, B, A, suggestion, C, them, a nice meal, D, me hungry, E, up your mind. Exercise three, make lunch, two, make a mess, Three, make me ill. Four, make you a drink. Five, make sense. And six, make up your mind. Okay? Is it clear? Yes? Okay, so you have all the patterns there. Good. Exercise three, make lunch. Make a mess. Make lunch, make a mess. Makes me ill. Number four, make you a drink. Make you a drink. Um, five, make sense. Six, make up your mind. Yes, okay. And I want you to highlight all the make expressions there. Okay, is it clear? Highlight with your highlighter. Let's go to page 37, exercise 7. Okay, good. You can't or you mustn't camp in the park. Two, you have to picnic in designated areas, yes? You can't or you mustn't swim in the river, you can't carry water with you, you have to contact the warden in advance of your visit, six, you don't have to show ident identification on entry, you shouldn't approach white animals, eight, you have to report any accidents or incidents with wild animals, okay? Let's go to page um, 
designated. Yes, I was checking the pronunciation. Yes, I love checking pronunciations. Yes, okay. Whenever you have a doubt, yes, you have to uh, make friends with the dictionary. Yes, okay. Because I think there is a generation of students that hate looking up words in the dictionary. I am not saying that this is generation is your generation, but yes, make friends with the dictionary. Yes, and maybe when you are bored, it is a good idea to read the dictionary also. Yes, it's very interesting. Yes, okay. You have such a bored teacher. Yes, okay. Good. Well, um, let's go to um, number um, two. Yes, okay, one, two. Okay, a goal to individuals. Resolutions, intrepid, five challenges, and six a platform. Three, Jodikov, two, Borch Oslan, three, Robert D. Ballard. Number four. This is a very good text, strategies for success, yes, okay. You may, you may you can highlight uh, the main words in your text, okay? And apart from that, it gives you ideas for talking, yes? Okay, number four. Uh, wait a minute. Good. If you make a healthy meal, you feel better afterwards. This is very easy for you. If I watch a movie, I enjoy myself. Three. If you find a new road to work, you'll save money. Four, if you take chewing gum with you, you won't or will not smoke. Five, if you don't buy chocolate, you won't eat it. You'll be longer if you have a good diet. Number five, you won't achieve anything unless, I can't get the concept. Yes, unless you take risks. You will, uh, your friends, your friends will help you as soon as you ask them. Three, you will be successful when you plan things carefully. This is the new thing, let's say. Yes, you revise uh, the, the conditioner, but we add more words, okay? Uh, these connectors, yes. You won't know what you can do until you cry. You'll make a lot of mistakes before you succeed. I agree, sometimes, yes, it's true. You won't save any money if you don't have a plan, okay? Number um, six, okay? Which things are not part of a healthy life? Well, cutting down on relaxation, avoiding outdoor activities, and taking up smoking, okay? Good, so bye-bye activity book. Okay, let's go to uh, the mistakes from Dream Job video. Paula, very interesting, very interesting, yes. I will use your video uh, to warm up because uh, I am uh, on, unit, uh, on a new unit in fifth year and um, it's a great video to introduce what a person think, thinks about a dream job, yes, okay. Um, well, so leisure, 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 yes, and creativity, creativity. Basic. There's three pronunciation mistakes. Okay, creativity, basic, and leisure. Leisure. Yes. Okay. Um, I, it, it was really, uh, really, really interesting. Uh, the part that you said. Yes. That women. You can share your video in the Facebook of Instituto Reino Unido. Yes, you too. Everybody can share it because sometimes I want to share, but I don't have time. Yes. For sharing all the videos yes okay uh, well the part that you said that women are less paid yes and this is true because women suffer are suffering have been suffering injustice yes okay so uh, this is a, a good topic the dream job you could have a job a woman, yes, can be well paid, yes, the same, equal salaries for women, yes, so I really like it, yes. Tiago, it's better, yes, it's better organized, uh, you uh, uh, try to introduce more vocabulary, pay attention, those things happen, not that thing happen, yes, okay. 
um, that the race was very good, yes? Remember, the more you use connectors, the more you use um, uh, new vocabulary, a specific vocabulary, uh, the, the, um, the more you introduce more uh, opinions, okay? It could be uh, better. Yes, that is what I wanted to say, yes, okay, so continue like this. Camila, it is better organized, yes, but, yes, you can. Another country, yes, uh, no other, yes, other countries for the plural. The employees, no, the employers, yes, I think you wanted to say the employees should have blah, blah, blah. Another thing, yes, okay, apparently, another thing, other things for the plural. Everybody needs rest at some point, yes, ese era tuyo, Tiago, eh? everybody needs rest at some point, yes, another, yes, because I have Camila's on the left side, yes, okay, another country, uh, other, yes, countries, the employees should have, another thing, yes, other things, everybody needs some rest at some point, yes, because you were talking that a uh, uh, 24-hour 24 24 hour people, yes, okay, you work, 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 but you need to rest at some point, yes, okay, Camila, working for long hours, for ING, for living, yes, pay, rises, you want to say, but I think a better payment was the, 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 the what you needed for that uh, sentence, a better payment, increase, they should have increased in their salaries, you can say, um, they hate getting, yes, Camila, it is better organized, as I was saying before, yes, but um, what we have to add for next video, more vocabulary, more specific vocabulary, and uh, more um, connectors, yes, however, for example, although um, but, and, because, yes, okay, and it would be better than now, okay, but it is, it is better, yes, but I want it to be the best, yes, okay, good, so, um, let's go, let's, let's go, I want you to put the date, I want you to put the date, page 62, 63, 64, 65, and 68 from the Class book. Okay, well done. Are you there? Sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, and blah blah blah. Yes, okay. So, if you have to say, uh, I want you to tell me. Yes, if you have to talk. Yes. Um, a caffeine-fueled world. Do you think we are <clears throat> addicted to coffee? What do you think? Why do we need coffee? Yes? Are you addicted to coffee? Yes? No? Why? Do you drink a lot of tea, a lot of coffee, a lot of mate cocido? Yes? I want you to tell me that. Yes? Uh, are we addicted to, to coffee? Is it our society, a society that must drink coffee? Because if we don't drink coffee, we can't exist, yes? Why do we drink coffee? Yes, do you think it is fuel? Yes, to our body? <clears throat> I am drinking some water now. Sorry. Okay. Well, <clears throat> so... Do you think, uh, is your lifestyle very different uh, to that of your parents' generation, for example? Do you often hear comments about modern life? What kind of commerce, comments? How much tea, coffee, or drinks do you have a normal day? That, th those questions I, I was asking, yes? Are you addicted to coffee? Yeah, so let's go. Um, Pictures, okay. Wait a minute.
different from your parents' generation? What do your parents used to drink, for example, in the past? Yes, okay. What do they drink? Did they drink a lot of, did they used to drink a lot of coffee? Yes. <coughs> yes. All right. There we are. Okay. So what can you see in that picture? What can you see in that picture? Yes. Okay. How many cups of coffee do you drink every day? How many cup of tea? Cup of coffee do you drink every day? Okay. So it shows a person drinking a lot of coffee. Do you think um, drinking coffee has benefits? What benefits? Advantages? Disadvantages? What advantages? Okay. So I want you to think about that. Okay. Okay. There is another person drinking coffee too. Yes. Okay. So when do you drink coffee? Very early in the morning? Yes. All day? Yes. In the siesta, after eating? Yes. Okay. Uh, another person drinking coffee? For relaxing? Yes. As a fuel? As fuel? Yes. For starting activities? <clears throat> to be awake? Yes. Okay. So it says caffeine. You have positive and negative effects. Yes. Okay. Increase attention and um, decrease fatigue. Yes. Okay. You can be alert. Alert. Yes. You can be alert. Yes. That's why many people, yes, uh, when they go to their jobs, yes, they need, when, for a starting job, they need to drink coffee. Yes. Because their ma brain must be alert. And what happened? <clears throat> what happened? Why you are not alert and you need, for example, our parents used to drink coffee in the past. Did they used to drink coffee in the past? <clears throat> How? How did they do to be alert? Yes, okay, no, because they didn't do anything. Now we do more things. We live in a 24-hour generation and we need to be alert all the time. But the thing is, why you need more caffeine? Yes? We work a lot. Yes? We spend so many hours in front of a computer doing work corrected in my case. So, in my case, so. What happens is that we sleep less. So, the next day, we are very sleepy. We have fatigue. Yes? So, what does our brain need? Yes, what does our, our brain need? It needs caffeine. We need to be alert. So that's why we drink and drink a lot of coffee. Yes, okay. Lower risk of, uh, <clears throat> of vascular disease, lower risk of diabetes, and increased metabolic rates. Rate. Negative effect. <clears throat> Sorry, anxiety. Increase our uh, vaso constriction of blood pressure. Reduce control of fine motor moving. Yes, okay. And uh, simulation, stimulation uh, of urination. So you go more, uh, more uh, times to the PP room, okay? <clears throat> okay, sorry. Yes, okay, so. You have benefits, uh, yes, and um, positive aspect and negative aspects, yes, okay. Here are five reasons to drink coffee, yes, okay. Do you agree? Protective, again, type 2 diabetes may help those with Parkinson's disease, yes, impressive benefits for brain health, lowers, it's, lowers it's the risk of liver liver cancer by 40 percent yes okay so is it clear or not yes okay do you drink a lot of coffee yes or no yes okay liver liver, liver sorry liver yes okay Liver. <clears throat> so i don't know yes just just think about uh what is this where we have the pictures? Yes, okay. 
So I want you to think about uh, why you need uh, this kind of fuel. Yeah. So, um, do you think it change drinking a lot of coffee change changes your mood? Yes. Yes or no? Yes. Okay. So um, you you need to drink coffee every day. Yes. Or you can't. With you can't. Uh, live without coffee yes do you think you have to cut down on coffee yes okay so i i want you to think about that yes okay um if you are drinking a lot of coffee maybe you have to cut down on coffee not give up drinking coffee but cut down on coffee yes listen to the expressions the teacher is using okay well um so far uh, we have talked about uh, caffeine and everything. So we can go to the book. Yes, okay. We can go to the book then. And then we are going to continue talking about uh, more things uh, we have prepared. Yes, for this class. Okay. Well, let's go to, um, well, think about uh, the things we have already talked about. Coffee. <coughs> Talk at home. Yes, okay. Yes, and tell me if you need, if, if, if drinking coffee is good for you and if you are alert. Yeah, because when I started, I, um, I had, because you know, I started at work at the same time and I need to be alert and awake for the studying, yes, and for doing all the corrections I needed to hand in to my boss. Yes, okay. So I'm planning and everything, yes, preparing things for the school. Yes, and <clears throat> I wasn't alert, yes, and I, I wasn't awake as, as I was supposed to be. And I said, no, I will continue drinking coffee because it's not for me, yes, okay, nothing, nothing happens to me, yes, okay. He said the same, say, uh, drink mate and drink coffee and you will be awake for many hours, yes, okay. In my body, it didn't happen, yes, if I wanted to sleep, I slept, yes, I sleep. Yes, all the same. Okay? <clears throat> well, <clears throat> sorry. Let's go to exercise um, two. You have an article there. Yes, caffeine fuel world. Yes, so I want you to do exercises two, three, four, nine, and twelve. Yes, and eleven too. Yes, okay. I want you to highlight all the words there. Yes, okay, in the text. Yes, okay. You know, nowadays, and in the text, you will, you will also see it, that we are used to drinking uh, energy drinks. Yes, okay. Uh, coffee, energy drinks. Yes, okay. Um, and it says that more, you know, when you are pregnant, when I was pregnant, I didn't drink coffee. There are some pregnant women that they do, that do this. Yes, but there are a lot of children, amount, a big amount of babies, or babies that are born with caffeine in their bodies yes okay tiny amounts but yes okay um, well so I want you to read yes okay um, uh, read the differences and it says one important part there it says traditional people went to sleep and woke up following sunset and sunrise yes okay uh, then the way we work changed and people did more in their jobs, yes? Consequently, we had to adapt electric light and cafe, caffeinated food and drink allowed and drink allowed people to follow a less natural work pattern, yes? Okay, without, um, without caffeine, the 24 society of the developed world simple couldn't exist. Do you... I highlighted this because I wanted to ask, do you agree with this? Yes, I agree with the idea that we, uh, as a society, we have changed. Yes, we have changed completely. Yes, because it's true that people in the past used to go to bed. We, yes, when we were children, we used to go to bed earlier than our children go. Yes, okay. But nowadays, we, we work all the time, uh, we answer messages late, you know, you go to bed, yes, you go to bed and it is supposed you go to sleep, yes, but no, 
you go to bed i'm okay i will answer my best friend she was re writing to me yes and i have lots of messages yes and now that i am that I, that I am in bed i will answer the messages so you go to bed and you are in bed you are supposed uh to be sleeping but you start well answering messages and then you found another message of a problem of someone and you continue and you continue and it's 2 uh, p.m. and you are awake so this changed hmm? our way of living yes we used to we used to go to bed very early now we used to go we are used to going to bed very late yes the amount of hours that we sleep is, is not we are sleeping is not enough yes so then the next day our brain is tired yes so that's why we need to consume yes more caffeine yes okay or those kind of energy drinks yes okay but then the body says okay stop until here you need to rest you need to sleep yes okay so um I agree with this, yes, the, the traditional eight hours sleeping have disappeared, yes, okay, so um, we are not physically, uh, mentally, as it says here, we are not physically, mentally or emotional uh, connected, yes, okay, we are, this, we are unplugged, yes, so this is the thing we have to um, uh, start, uh, these are the things we need to um we need to get back to all those th traditional things yes okay uh but uh, do you think it could be possible in the 24 society yes okay so uh, our children also go to sleep very late yes because we are awake yes we have dinner late and it's a consequence of everything yes and it makes a big big and bigger uh ball yes so well we have to think about it yes okay so why and then we have the question why we work for so many hours yes okay so it's interesting yes so i want you to think about all these topics yes and we are going to talk about this uh the 24 our society in the next video yes it could be very interesting to listen to your ideas okay if you agree if you disagree yes okay but I, I, I highlighted those parts because uh, uh, that was uh, interesting yes okay well so I want you to go to page I will um, page 62 I will give you the answers remember to stop the video do the activities and then um listen to um the answers yes okay and then we are going to continue talking i'm going to show you some pictures of the about the 20 uh, no i will show you now um pictures about 24 hour society so then we continue we move um to uh another thing yes okay good so as we were saying yes um we work a lot yes so uh i think and we don't find a balance between our personal our personal life and our work so it would be very interesting yes uh if we find a real balance yes between work and life yes okay how we can do it we have to go back to the past yes do uh, all the things our parents used to do yes yeah, so think about that yeah have you got a balance yeah when you are not working have, have your parents got a balance yes between um work and life yeah so it would be very interesting yes okay the the thing i was saying we sleep less hour you know it's three it happens to me yes okay it happens to me because this um the last week I was uh, correcting until three. Then the other day I got up seven. Yes, so I didn't sleep all the uh, the amount of hours I was supposed to sleep. Yes, so it is like this. 
yes, it is like this. Yes, okay, it's a, um, it's a pity, but we need to find a balance between work and personal life. This is very interesting. Yes, okay, sleep well, because then if you don't sleep well, you feel tired in the afternoon, yeah, in the morning, in the next morning. Yes, okay. Good. Yes. Uh, do you think that 24 hour society uh, consume, uh, consume, um, consume a lot of junk food? Yes, okay. Is it true? What do you think? Yes, okay. Uh, well, you know. It's late, you should be sleeping, yes, or sharing a moment with your couple, but no, you are working, yes, okay, until late, yes, so this is shift work, yes, shift work and night work, yes, a work and a lifestyle, yes, okay, well, you're working all the time, yes, because you need to hand in papers, you need to, uh, the boss asks you many things, <clears throat> so you take your job, yes, ship work, fatigue, yes, okay, the boss is there, yes, you, have, you know, what's this, coffee, yes, but all the same, you are there, sleeping, yes, all the post is there in your computer, yes, all the things, all the uh, activities, yes, you have to fulfill, yes, okay, and this is the thing. Yes, okay, I don't know if you can appreciate in the, it's, it's, um, there is a lot of sun there, light, no sun, because it's cloudy today, but there is a mummy and uh, a sun there, it's the bathroom, might be it is the bathroom, because on the right side of the bed there is a lamp on the night table, I suppose, and they are using a uh, smartphone, so uh, and the, 20, uh, the 24 hour society is a society that is addicted to smartphones. Yes, okay? It's a pity. Yes, okay? So, top tips for shift, for shift, shift workers. Yes, okay? And you have a, <laughs> the tips there. Yes, okay? Well, yes? I think you can describe the pictures at home, yes, okay, coffee, yes, sleeping, yes, okay, there we have, a boy, yes, night shift in a row, if possible to allow uh, you to recover more effectively, yes, rest days, yes, a feet black out blinds, yes, in your bathroom, to care with sleep when you are at home because sometimes the thing is that the ship the ship work it happened yes because you need to work at night yes but then in the morning you need to sleep so it's uh, your timetable is changed you, so it says okay blackout blinds yes okay no blackout y con las cortinas blackout por eso se le dice blackout yes porque Para que no te entre el sol, yes, okay, to avoid the sun, sunlight, okay, uh, avoid uh, alcohol after the shift, it may help you for, uh, you fall asleep, but will inhibit the quality of your sleep, ensure that there is bright light in your place of work to promote alertness, yes, okay, I do this, I do this, yes, okay, uh, I work with the sunlight, yes, okay, good, uh, limit caffeine towards the end of shifts, try to avoid long commuter commutes to and from shift work, okay, so these are tips, yes, okay, these are tips, okay, well, so uh, this was uh, the 20 hours for society, the 20 hours society, yes, okay, well, um, these were ideas. Remember when I projected pictures, I give you ideas, yes, for you to follow your mind with ideas. So when you go to the talking part, yes, okay. Now let's go very quickly to the corrections. Yes, okay. Number two, remember to pause the video, do the activities, and then listen to the answer. Don't cheat. Okay. Daily life increases. Number three, increases risk, pain, asthma. Number four, ingredient, move, warning, pattern, awake. 
Yes, this is four. Okay, exercise nine. Nine, 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 nine. Okay? So, pay attention because you have the use of so. Yes, okay. And I want you to highlight all the so examples here. Thank you so much. I'm so happy. I didn't eat. So, I'm hungry. Yes, okay. Uh, are you okay so far? Yes, okay. Do you like the, cra the classes so far? Yes, you know, hasta ahora. Yes, well done. ¿Quién me dijo por ahí? Okay. Um, well, so I want you to highlight them. Yes, okay. Uh, number 10, are you there? Uh, we have, uh, I've had five cup of tea so far or coffee. Thank you so much for what, so, uh, what you have done. Yes, okay, for everything you have done. I'm so happy I could sing, dance, kiss you. Okay, see you in the video. Yes, number four, uh, call, ring me, text me, message me. Number five, hope. Yes, okay, six, think. I don't think so. Don't be so hard on yourself. Don't be so ignorant, yes? Don't be so mean with me, yes, okay? Number seven, chocolate, give up chocolate, give up smoking, okay? Stop, yes, okay? Uh, remarkable, amazing, a coincidence can be, yes? Oh, that's it. A coincidence, quite coincidence, yes. Coincidence, okay, amazing, yes, okay. 11, 11, close, today, all, on, night, day, yes, okay. And I want you to highlight 24 hour shopping, okay, these things are typi typical. Do you agree or not? Pongale talking, por favor, ahí. Talking. Talking. Okay. So, do you agree? Are these things positive or negative? Which one affect you? In what way? What are, the, what are some consequences for you or for other people? Do you think these are typical things of a 24-hour society? Yes, they are. 24-hour shopping. Difficult sleeping. Yeah. Okay, difficulty in, uh, sleeping. Yes, okay, I don't have problems, uh, I don't have difficulties um, in sleeping, but the thing is that I sleep very late. Yes, okay, because there are some people who uh, go to bed and they are awake. They can't sleep, they can't sleep. And they, need, they need to drink some drugs for sleeping. Yes, eating, take of course, prescribed by the doctor. Eating, take away food, shift work, yes, smartphone addiction and tiredness, yes. The other day, oh, I am very tired, yes, so this is typical for the 20 hour society. Yes, okay, tell at home if you agree or if you disagree. So let's go to pages 64, 65 and 68, eating out. What are the most important things to consider when eating out? Yes, does it depend on what sort of occasion it is? Yes, I agree. Because if you are, uh, if you, it is a wedding anniversary, a wedding anniversary, you would choose another kind of restaurant, other kind of restaurant, another kind of restaurant. And if you are, uh, if, if the date, for example, is more informal with friends and everything, I could go to a pizzeria, maybe. So, I want you to highlight this, the atmosphere, yes, and all the words there, yes, all the charts and everything, Remember, must be highlighted as always. Yes, okay, Vandim. Okay, well, uh, the atmosphere in the restaurant, the food choice or the quality, the prices or value for money, the service. So I want you to put the stages in eating out from an A, A to H into the logical order from sentences, um, from words from one to eight, okay? Is it clear? There we go. 1A, stop the video. 2, and then listen to the answers. 1A, 2F, 3G, 4B, 5D, 6C, 7A, 8E. 4, 
dummy. Yes, okay, so uh, I want you to put the things, uh, the sentences that are said by a costumer and by a waiter, okay? W for waiter and uh, C for costumer. One, waiter. Two, waiter. Three, costumer. Four, costumer. Five, costumer. Six, waiter. Seven, costumer. Eight, waiter. Nine, costumer. Ten, waiter. And eleven, waiter. Let's go to exercise five. Yes, you are going to look at the expressions for describing dishes. Listen to the conversation again. How are the dishes in the photo described? How are the dishes in the photo described? Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. There we are. It's very windy. Track 41, Unit 5D. Are you ready to order? Um, not quite. No problem. Would you like something to drink while you decide? Yes, please. Just water's fine for the moment. Oh, this menu looks interesting. I love trying new dishes. What's a plantain fritters? What? Do you like trying new dishes? Yes, do you dare add to everything? I don't. Yes, I like trying dishes, but not very, very... Ah, uh, you know, sophisticated, fancy dishes, if we could say that, yes? Okay. Well, plantain is a kind of banana, and a fritter is a fried dish. In this case, fried mashed banana balls. Do you mean like sweet dessert banana? No, plantain is a type of savoury banana you eat as a vegetable. It's quite a bland flavour, really. Okay, but what about acra? What's that mean? Okay, and... I want you to highlight all the words that we use that uh, it's they are sort of type of kind of baked, boiled, fried dish, fruit, meat, fish, vegetable, yes, a kind of bean, yes, it tastes, yes, okay, bland, hot, salty, sweet, spicy, yes, okay, uh, they are a bit like, yes, lamb, like bananas. Made from? It's made from a kind of bean called black-eyed peas. They're fritters too. Hmm, what do they taste like? Well, acra's usually pretty hot and spicy. Sounds good. I think I'll try that. Now, what's this? Aki and saltfish. Where's that? In the main courses, at the top of the list. Ah, uh, yes. I think aki's a kind of fruit that's traditionally served with saltfish. And saltfish? That's dried salted cod. You have to soak it in water before you cook it. But then it's a bit like fresh cod. It doesn't taste salty when it's cooked. OK, I might try that. Uh, what are you going to have? I can't make my mind up. Oh, here comes the waiter again. Can I take your order now? Yes, please. I'll have the acra to start with. And I'll have the same. And for your main course? I'd like to try the ackee and saltfish. Does it come with vegetables? Mm. Yes, with plantain. And how's that cooked? Is it fried? No, it's boiled. OK, that sounds fine. And what about you, madam? Can I have the goat curry, please? Certainly. I've never tried goat. You can try some of mine when it comes. It's like lamb, but the flavour's a bit stronger. OK, great. Okay, so the woman chooses acra and um, saltfish, and the man chooses goat curry. Yes, okay, curry. Yes, okay, well, good luck to them. Okay, exercise eight. Um, well, this is for you to practice because we are going to do this uh, in the video too, because it will be divided in what you think. I mean, I'm thinking it was about the next video. Uh, it's, going, it's going to be divided in what you think uh, about 24 hour, describe 24 hour um, society, 24 hour people, and other 24 hour people. And then you are going to uh, choose a dish and you are going to describe this dish using these words, okay? And in exercise 8, it says write a list of six food dishes, vegetables, fruit, or other food which either are either from your country or which you have eaten abroad. 
make notes uh, which describe each item, yes, okay, use expressions, so take turns to describe, and then the, the other person have to guess, yes, we were supposed to do this guessing game, yes, here in the class, but we can't, so you are going to describe on the second part of the video, yes, one minute uh, and a half, for, um, one minute and a half, one minute and a half for describing the 24-hour society, and one minute and, a, minute and a half for describing a dish, Yes, the one you like, yes, or the one you would like to try, no, 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 the one you like because you will be able to describe more effectively, yes, okay, well, so let's go to page 65, we are on the uh, form, I want you to do exercise 5, exercise 1, 3, B, 4 and, well, you know, 4 and 5 are part of the homework, Yes, okay? And I want you to highlight this, yes, in the text. As a result, therefore, in addition, this will lead to, and in exercise B, as a result, consequently lead to, mean, result in, therefore. Okay? Good. Um, good. Well, let's go. Yes, remember to do the activities and then listen to the answer. Pause the video, please. All right? There we are. One B. Yes, let's go to exercise three. Okay, one, cause. You put the blench on the food. Consequences, it becomes inedible, inedible, you can't eat it, inedible. This is another adjective that describes, uh, a negative adjective to describe food. Cause, well, cause two, if you stop putting bleach on the food, you throw it, you throw out. Consequence, people can make, yes, use of it. Cause three. More people will be able to buy the food consequences, less waste and more profit for you. Okay? B, 3B. As a result, consequently, therefore. 2, lead to, mean, result in. 3, as a result, consequently, therefore. 4, mean, 5, mean, lead to, result in. 6, as a result, consequently, and therefore. Yes? Okay, good. Well, so whenever you, dis uh, um, you know, whenever you write letters, you know, you have already written formal letters, but uh, as a reminder, take into account, yes, all these things, yes, the organization of the paragraphs. Pay attention. No salten renglones, yes. Dejen, porque acá ustedes van a ver que tienen espacios. Ustedes van a dejar sangría. Porque qué es lo que hace la sangría, ya sabemos, deben siempre separar los párrafos. ¿Ok? Por ejemplo, you will start dear sir or madam, mother, madam, I'm sorry. ¿Ok? You start writing here. Yes, we are writing, ta, 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 this letter, uh, because. Y empieza, este es el espacio que queda desde el margen de la hoja hasta aquí, sangría. ¿Ok? Ta, 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 comienza, ta, acá viene tu otro párrafo, yes, ok, there are several, bla, 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 a la misma altura de Will, de ver, a, in addition, pa, 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 termino la carta, if you uh, don't know the name of the person who you are writing to, yours faithfully, if you know the name of the person, eh? person you are writing to your sincerely yes okay uh, the uh, paragraphs are divided by sangria yes okay uh, connectors as a result of therefore in addition yes okay the remember the format yes formal yes it's a formal style yes formal vocabulary okay is it clear uh, well so we are writing to express our shock at the news, yes, okay, and in our view, yes, highlighted too, yes, there are several local organizations in addition, they would lead to, okay, so you have to react to any of the, the, um, the situations in number four, okay, 
Organize your ideas, 120 words, okay? Uh, respect the task, yes, okay, and the format. Let's go to the last thing we have to do, page 68, page 68, I want you to do exercises 1, 4, 5, 7, and 8, <clears throat> and uh, 9, for a 3 minutes video, yes, because we are going to use this um, list for the 3 minutes video, así nos acordamos y bosquejamos en nuestro próximo trabajo. Okay, our next uh, job. Good. So let's go to grammar. Yes, okay. Remember to pause the video, do the activities, and then listen to the answers. Okay, so you know you have to cross out the incorrect options. Okay, I show two must, three have to, four will be, five. Yes, you know. Where is five? Yes, okay. Uh, six will also, seven I am I allow to, eight must, nine will stick, ten dash, okay, eleven mustn't, twelve eaten, can't, sorry, thirteen you'll, fourteen do, do I have to? Yes, okay. Yes, okay. Exercise four. Okay. Are you there? Okay, well, you have to do. I think I buy a bike. If you buy a bike, here I want you to write the conditionals in exercise four. Okay. If I will buy, if I, I think I will buy a bike. If you buy a bike, you will get more exercises. Yes. If you give up smoking, yes. You will be healthier. If you join the gym, yes, you will be fit. If you take a holiday, you will rest. If you give up uh, meat, yes, okay, your blood uh, pressure will be better, I think, yes, okay? So write examples, yes, to practice, okay? But with unless, yes, I want you to put unless, yes, okay, the new, uh, the, the connectors, okay? Good. Exercise 5. Reduce. Acordate esto, por favor, marcalos porque son los de la unidad. Yes? Reduce, cut down on. You have to cut down on sugar. Yes? I gave examples during the class. I don't know if you were uh, paying attention. Start. Do you have to take up? Do you have to take up the gym? I think you should. Yes? Well, now we can't. Yes? Because we are in quarantine. Yes, but take up uh, doing activities at home. Yes, working out. Yes, okay. Stop, give up. Yes, you have to give up smoking. You have to, you got, uh, you have to cut uh, out smoking. Yes, cut out or on uh, cut out on milk on a lot of uh, on a lot of sugar. Sorry, no milk. Okay, good. Um, cutting out on sugar. Yes, I have already given you the examples, okay? Well, seven, are you seven? I sometimes book my book the table when we eat out in a restaurant, but usually my husband does it. I never have started, I don't want to eat too, too much, so I save myself, you know, for the dessert instead. Yes, you have to choose, yes? I usually leave uh, a tip, yes? Okay, I have something there. Uh, leave a tip. Yes, you know what? Leave a tip. Do, are you used to leaving tips? Yes, okay. Uh, in the United States, my sister told me that you have to tip everywhere. Yes, okay. Because I think it is more important to show your appreciation, appreciation of the service in a restaurant. Well, maybe. Yes, okay. If, if wait, I, I leave tips if waiters or I think that we should leave tips if waitress and waitress uh, waiters and waitresses uh, do more than what we expect because if the service is completely awful you don't have to leave tips of course I wouldn't yes do that I think it's uh, what I always pay uh, the bill by credit card it is easier uh, that way 
and it means I have a record of how much I pay. Yes, number eight, kind, sort, number two, made, number three, fruit, and number four, raw. Yes, have you ever eaten raw meat, raw, a raw steak, a tartare? Yes, okay, good. Well, uh, it's time for next class. I hope you have enjoyed the class. See you next class. Bye-bye.